lost to the sea. Just 30 years ago, this Buddhist temple in Thailand was in the middle of the village it served. But the seawaters are advancing at a rate of nearly 30 metres every year along some parts of the coastline. The villagers fled years ago, rebuilding their homes several hundred metres inland. But the abbot is standing firm. If the temple were moved, people wouldn't know there used to be a temple here that was destroyed. But if we stay and we gradually develop, we can go on. The Gulf of Thailand boasts some of the world's largest mangrove forests. The mangrove roots used to hold together these shores, but swathes were cleared to make way for shrimp farms and salt production plants. A quarter of the Thai coastline, some 700 kilometers, is thought to be affected by coastal erosion. Now there's a push to try to restore the fragile ecosystem. These volunteers have come from Bangkok to help replant the seawater forest. Bangkok's mangrove forest has been eroded. In fact, Bangkok's demarcation is now in the sea, some two kilometers in the sea from where the people live. Bamboo barriers and cement pylons are also being used to shore up the coastline. But the loss of mangrove forests is not the only problem. Climate change is also playing a part. The web and Thai and Thailand is higher than before. Even you, you grow, a lot of mangrove cannot help. The floating monastery is now a symbol of Thailand's disappearing shores. But with only 6% of mangroves able to recover and climate change getting worse, many fear it's too little, too late.